Hi you guys, so we're back again with another thrifting video. I've actually been thrifting this whole month and I've taken my camera and recorded little snippets but I never finished the video. So in this video, I want to include all my little thrift clips and do a little haul at the end because I feel like I've gotten enough things that I could do like a pretty big haul. So yeah, and I'm excited. I feel like everything I got was cool. I actually just got out of the thrift store like 20 minutes ago and I picked up these two really cool jewelry pieces that I'll show you guys like right now. Actually, let me show you literally right now. But basically, I went to a thrift store this morning with my brother because my brother was like hey can you take me to the thrift store with you and i was like you know what let's go i wasn't really shopping for myself but i did look around a little bit and i saw the jewelry section and because it's like coachella season and like summer season i feel like i've been seeing a lot of like really cool outfits i had to flip the camera because there was a glare but basically i saw this picture and look at all like the body jewelry that she has on like all those body chains i thought they were so pretty she has like a bunch of necklaces and i feel like it adds so much to the outfit so I was in the jewelry section at the thrift store and I was trying on a bunch of like body chains basically. And look what I found. I literally found the exact same body chain she has on. Like what is the coincidence of the same body chain that she had on? Like the only inspo picture that I brought. And I find the exact same chain. And do you guys see that? 350? No. But anyways, let's get into all the clips of me thrifting for the past month basically. And then we'll get into the haul. Okay, so I'm going to have to voice over some of these parts, but we made it to the first thrift store and we start right now. Okay, so I found these two belts. There's this one that's like braided, but I don't really like that it has these like gold dots. And we have this one and I think it'll look really nice with like a low-waisted belt or skirt. So I think I'm going to get it. They also have it in black with like a really nice buckle. Do you guys get the vision? Like I know it looks kind of ugly, but yeah. I looked through all these pants because I'm looking for men's dress pants that I could wear like low-waisted. And I found a couple. Okay, these are black with like stripes all over it. Then this one is black, but it has like a satiny finish. And then I found the gray pair, but I'm gonna try them on. I hope they fit how I want them to fit. And then I always check the jewelry section, but this case was locked and I would have had to call someone over to open it and I got shy, but I wanted to try that wiggly silver bracelet in the back. And then I thought that layered beaded necklace was pretty, borderline grandma, but still very pretty. Like imagine it with like an off the shoulder shirt. Okay, so this is the first belt. I feel like I could wear it with a low skirt or like low waisted jeans, kind of like that. Maybe a little bit tighter, so it's like that. The next belt is this one, but it literally won't fit. It's like meant for kids. See, I think it's so pretty, but it won't buckle. I'm gonna take this one too, look how pretty. And then I found the scarf and I really like the pattern on it and like the material, but I'm gonna see if I could wear it as like a mini skirt or maybe as a top. I see the vision, but it's way too short. Maybe as like a swimsuit cover up, maybe as a top, but I'm not really feeling it. Okay, voice over time, but I was trying too hard to make the scarf work that I decided to just leave it because it should not be this hard. But yeah, now onto the pants. I love the fit of these pants, but they were baggy enough that you had like that little slit in the back of your pants where you could see your underwear. So that was a no. And then these were the black ones. I actually found dress pants in the women's section that were baggy and fit nicely at the waist, but I guess I didn't record it. So I'll show it at the end on the try on section. See the conditions I be in? but i made it to the thrift store this thrift store looks like a house but it honestly has such cool finds in here damn i walk right in and the first thing i see is this necklace thrift store jewelry finds i'm telling you guys they're so like pretty and unique i love it and i just want to get into wearing jewelry more i feel like it elevates or adds character to any outfit like even if i'm wearing a swimsuit imagine i throw on like layered necklaces a low waist chain or like an anklet like it just spices it up and it was only like three dollars they also had this black velvet choker necklace but i probably wouldn't wear it so i just left it but i thought it was cool to show oh and then i found this red satin slip dress in my size what are the odds and everything was 50 percent off so it came out to 750 like what look at the fit on that hugs everywhere super soft double layered and and it had a built-in bra then I found these dress shorts that I thought fit nice, maybe for like a night out in the summer. I don't know. I think it's a good basic to have and to like add to. The pattern on these pants were cool, but they didn't fit me. But I just wanted to show you guys. It kind of gave like kitchen table vibes. Okay, so now I think we're on to the third thrift store. When I walked in, the first thing I saw was a skirt and I was like, oh, I'm undressing her. And so I called someone over. And then I always look at the bags because I'm specifically looking for beaded bags. And there was only this one, which was a no for me. Also, I'm on the lookout for leather shorts, but these were tight and I'm looking more for like a loose fit. And then here's a cute little montage that I randomly decided to record. Don't sleep on the PJ section. I found this beautiful slip dress, but it was too big on me, so I didn't take it. But how cute. Okay, so now we made it to the fitting room. Here's her skirt. Beautiful. I also found this Nike windbreaker, and it was only $8, but I didn't really want basic pieces. Like, I would much rather have, like, a cool wear find, so I just didn't get it. This top, obsessed. 
very questionable on the hanger but imagine it in the spring or summer with low waist cargoes i'm gonna cinch it in at the waist area which is what i'm pulling on the bag because it's definitely worn and not as stretchy and then the last thing i got at the store store was this gorgeous necklace for 250 i rest my case okay so now time for the haul i've literally been collecting all these items for like a month now and i'm so happy with everything i got i feel like i'm being very intentional with the type of things that i'm thrifting some of these items you've already seen throughout the video and some you haven't so let's just get started so the first item is this red satin slip dress <gasps> beautiful like someone invite me to like a wedding or like a fancy event that i could wear this to because otherwise it's gonna sit in my closet but such a good find for like a thrift store the next item i actually already wore like to the beach but it's this blue long maxi skirt beautiful and the brand is st john's Bay. the next item is this brown beaded skirt i bought it in new york when i went on a thrift trip i was in a thrift store called second ave it's pretty heavy so i could tell that the quality is really good i like that it goes straight across because some skirts i have like a little v cup and then let me show you a little close-up how pretty i'm actually gonna try it on with the brown basic shirt that i have just to dress it down to see what it looks like but i think it's a look we'll see if it's a look and the next item are these pair of dress shorts i love that they're seamless so like there's not really a button there's like a clasp on the inside and even the pockets are like seamless the front and the back ones and i like that they're a little bit loose and look at the material it feels like leggings but they're not they're like dress shorts and then i got another pair of dress pants but they're in the room i'm gonna go get them okay there are these gray Calvin Klein dress pants. They go all the way down and they're straight leg and like straight throughout the leg. They're also very similar material to the shorts. Like they're very stretchy. Like honestly, I would rather wear dress pants over wearing jeans just because they feel more comfortable. Like I feel like they feel like joggers or like sweatpants or even like even leggings. I'll enter some pictures of the type of vibe I'm going for with these dress pants. And then we have like this knitted crochet white t-shirt. If you look really closely, it has like some gray like sparkle to it. But yeah, it's a size medium, so it's a little bit big on me. So I'm going to have to cinch in like the bottom area. But I think after that, a look. Okay, now we have these True Religion jeans. Love them so much. This is what they look like. It has like this brown stitching all throughout. And I like that the back pockets are like pretty dramatic. And yeah, I don't know what else to say about them. But this was such a good find. I love them so much. I feel like I got a lot of dress clothes, but the next item is this vest. I think this vest is so flattering. I wasn't wearing a bra on the try and I feel like I gave them like a lift. I also feel like because it's a little bit tight, it's also pretty stretchy. So because it's stretchy, it kind of like cinches in and pushes up. I don't know, but I'm digging it. I'm digging it. The last clothing item I have are these cargo shorts. I feel like they're not a very dramatic cargo. It's kind of like a neutral cargo, which I like. Okay, moving on to the accessories. The first belt is this black one. It's like a woven material and it's from the brand American Eagle. And the next one is this like brown cowgirl one. Cute, cute. I also think it will look good with like the cargo pants. Like, see? Maybe not like to the middle, but kind of like loose hanging. Are we feeling it? And then I forgot to talk about the body chains that I found. So this is the first one with the circles and the blue. And then the second one is like a pearly white one. Now onto the favorite item I thrifted was this bag. Let me get out of the frame, but look at this. It has like all these little tiny pearls all over it. And then look at the handle. <gasps> Beautiful. And then this is the inside. And then you know what the crazy thing is? I thrifted the same exact bag like a year ago at a different thrift store and it's literally the same thing So like the handle has these beads and then the bag also has these like little pearls all over it And then the inside I believe is brown So cute and then the last bag I found was from the kids section, but how pretty is this? Like imagine it in the summer with jeans or like a cute white maxi skirt like, I feel like this is a perfect like summer statement bag or even like a vacation bag And the inside is not that big but it at least fits like my phone and like a card holder And that's all a girl needs And I got this bag at the same thrift store that I got the white bag And I believe both bags together were less than $12 like I rest my case But yeah that is the end of the thrift haul I hope you enjoyed it Thank you for watching and see you very soon Bye Ich bin nicht verlassen